And hello there, and welcome back to our Mass Effect preview, uh, our Mass Effect playthrough. Yeah, sorry. Um, so, uh, if you notice a little bit of the change in the audio quality from my microphone, I am using my spare mic. Uh, I shouldn't say audio quality, but if you, if you notice that the voice sounds just a tiny bit different, that is the reason why I'm using my spare mic, because my, my, uh, my main mic... Uh, I need to get something, I need to uh, fix the headset a little bit. Um, but right now, what we're going to do is we're going to start Mass Effect 3. Now, I, I I kind of, I went over this at the end uh, of the video for Mass Effect 2, after I had secured all of the squad mate survival in the final mission so we can get them in this game. Um, and... Uh, I went over the fact that I didn't really enjoy the ending and that I would be playing Mass Effect 3 uh, Legendary Edition with mods on. And I do have four mods that are going to be going during this game. One of them is the aforementioned Happy Ending mod, which somebody thankfully made a newer version of it uh, that goes to... Um, that goes for the Legendary Edition. Um, we also are going to have uh, the Citadel mod, which I mentioned before, which puts the Citadel DLC at the end of the game as a post-credits thing, and also tweaks the dialogue a little bit so that that works narratively. Um, and then the other thing that we, the other two that we also have is we have a patch fixer for a lot of the visual and audio glitches that we've been seeing in Mass Effects One and Two Legendary Editions. Uh, Mass Effect 2 specifically, I, we, we had a lot of audio glitches where the lip syncing was not on uh, with the audio. Um, or it would be, the audio would play before the lip syncing scene, so it would be off and then it would cut to the next audio scene and cut it off at the end. We had that problem a few times. Um, so that's supposed to fix little things like that, and it's also supposed to... And we also have, uh, for the last one, we have the um, Expanded Galaxy mod. Which basically allows you to have a bit more story elements in the story. Uh, it, re it redoes a lot of the resource system that you have in the game. Um, and the resource system in this game is actually pretty fun. I do like the resource system and the way they kind of do it. Uh, but like I said, we're, we're, we're playing with all of those active now. Uh, so once we do the game, if you guys notice anything different from what you would normally... From what you had in your playthrough of this... That is probably the reason why, is because uh, those uh, those mods are currently in effect. Um, and I will pre preface this by saying that I have never played any of the DLC for this game. I only played through this game once when it came out, because I was that dissatisfied uh, with the ending of it. But we are bringing over our Sheps from Mass Effect 1 and 2, so we're going to start a new game. Import Mass Effect 2 character. Cecil Shepard, yep. Okay, so this was our last save. Uh, so we're going to stick with this one. So, uh, And these are all the choices that we made as well, so we can see these. Um, killed the Rachni Queen, so we did that in Mass Effect 1. Rascued, rescued, rescued, rascals! Uh, rescued Ashley Williams on Vermeer. We chose to leave Caden. Uh, we chose to save the Council at the cost of humans' lives. We saved Malin's uh, data in Mass Effect 2. This is the first one from Mass Effect. Uh, this is one of the only ones from... Well, actually, this is they're kind of mixed in here. Uh, but that's from Mass Effect 2. That was from Morden's uh, loyalty quest. We kept Rex alive on Vermeer, which we knew that. Uh, chose to rewrite the Geth Heretic. So that was Legion's quest. So we chose not to blow up the, the Heretic Geth. We chose to have them reintegrated into the Geth hole. Uh, we destroyed the Collector base instead of saving it for Cerberus, because fuck the elusive man. Uh, we survived the suicide mission with 12 squad mates. So that means that we... I believe that means that we got all of the squad mates uh, out during the suicide mission. We didn't lose any squad mates. Um, we, mo we romanced Liara before Mass Effect 2. So that's gonna, that's gonna come in interesting, because we romanced Tali in Mass Effect 2. Uh, and those two have have a bit of a history because they were also both in the first game with you, even though you couldn't romance Tali in that game. So we'll, we'll see how how weird this gets. Flying through space and stuff. Okay, uh, we're going to accept the import face. We're going to keep with the infiltrator class because we've kept with the infiltrator class the whole time, so I'm not changing that. Cecil Shepard, Spacer, War Hero, Infiltrator. Okay, so that is all of our backstory on this Shepard. And he also had all of his facial scars repaired in Mass Effect 2 because we invested in that on the Normandy. So we'll accept this. 
Choose enter to confirm your selections. You cannot make changes to your character after this point. Shepard's... Okay. Okay, settings for the Legendary Edition 3. Citadel Epilog mod. Okay, so community patch settings. Citadel Epilog mod and Amade... All right, so these are the main ones we're using. Um, the other one that we don't see in here is the Expanded Universe mod, but I think that's because... Um, Okay. All right. So, hang on a second. So, but let, let's let, let's go. So, level settings, story settings. Okay. So, these sections contain spoilers. So, what I'm going to do is I'm not um, I'm not going to show this on here just in case this does spoil people. Um, but I will I will come right back as soon as we're done with this. Okay, so I think I have um, gone through all these. Uh, so I think we have everything enabled for this. And since the uh, the system is um, since the, the the system is identifying these, I think we're okay. So we're gonna keep going. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd oh, stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. In 2157, humanity discovered it was not alone in the universe. 30 years later, they found a peaceful place among dozens of galactic species, but this idyllic future is overshadowed by a dark past. Reapers, a sentient race of machines responsible for cleansing the galaxy of all organic life every 50,000 years, are about to return. The leader of the galaxies are paralyzed by indecision, unable to accept the legend of Reapers as fact, but one soldier has seen the legend come to life, and now the fate of the galaxy depends on him. Mass Effect 3! Okay, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna prerequisite this, and this is gonna sound really, really asshole-ish. Uh, but screw that kid. Commander, you're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. Yeah. I got hard nipples. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. James, I need to know how your shoulders are that big. Anderson? Admiral? You back look in, good, Shepard. Back in his military uniform. a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. You know we're not ready if it is then. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the Defense Committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the Committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. You've faced down a Reaper. Hell, you spoke to one, then blew the damn thing up. You've seen how they harvest us, what they plan to do to us. You know more about this enemy than anyone. That why they grounded me? Took away my ship? You know that's not true. When you blew up the Batarian Relay, hundreds of thousands of Batarians died. It was that or let the Reapers walk through our back door. I know that, Shepard. And so does the Committee. If it wasn't for that, you'd have been court-martialed and left to rot in the brig. That, in your good word? Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. 
They're expecting you too, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Shepard! Ashley? Lieutenant Commander? How'd it go in there? I can never tell with them. I'm just waiting for orders now. Lieutenant Commander? You hadn't heard? No. I'm a bit out of the loop these days. Sorry, sir. Didn't mean to keep you out of the loop. I'm sure you had your reasons. Yeah, I guess I did. Still, good to see you. Admiral. Come on. You know the commander? I used to. Big booty bitches. They made Ashley a lot hotter in this. They definitely upped the hotness of a lot of the Mass Effect 1 characters in this. Or at least the women. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Bum, bum, bum. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. More powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But... There must be some way. If we're gonna have any chance at surviving this, we have to stand together. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? They couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. Oh, you're fucked. We heard from Admiral Hackett. What do we do? The only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. We're bound. <sighs> Welcome to the party! Oh, they're all fucking dead. Woo! Ow, my dick! Oh, God, my dick. I got hit so hard in the dick. Shepard! Shepard! Come on, get up. Here, take this. We've got to get moving. Oh shit, Sherlock. This is Admiral Anderson. Report in anyone. The Admiral de Bord Lieutenant is dead. Commander Williams, is that you? What's your status? I can't raise the Normandy. You'll have to contact them. We'll meet you at the landing zone. Anderson out. Well, shit. They're massive. Come on, Shepard. Ashley's headed to the Normandy. 
Okay, before we go... Ooh, I, I can go right to mod settings from here. That's nice. Okay, so before we do that, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to options quick. Uh, can I... Okay, so that's just the... So not that. What I want is... Do I have subtitles? Film grain, video mode, dynamic. Okay, not that. Calibration, sound controls, key binding, gameplay. Shepard's helmet. Often convers... Okay, yeah. Okay. Conversation mode, full decisions. Subtitles on. Okay. They'll pick us up if we can get to the spaceport. Let's move! Let's move! Run, bitch! Look out! Fudge! How do you stop something so powerful? By building something bigger Take to blow it up jump. with? It's farther than it looks! Leap! Come on, let's go! Run, Anderson! Come on! He runs like a witch. We'll have to go this way. Oh yeah, they introduced ladders and shit in this too. Like the platforming elements they introduced in this are actually a lot better than the previous ones. Looks clear, let's go. They brought back this thing though, with Lieutenant the vaulting Commander, system. You read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're almost to the Normandy. I've got Lieutenant Vega with me, but we're taking heavy fire. Oh yeah, we're James Vega. James Pass. Vega is your rando guy. Take him out. Where? Oh. Shoot him. I'm out of ammo. Come on, we gotta move. Let's go. Have to take these things out the old-fashioned way. Melee. <laughs> The melee is, uh, the melee is actually one of the biggest improvements, uh, in this. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Run! Oh, that was a mom-and-pop restaurant. I also have no goddamn ammo. Gotta find a way out of here. Give me a med kit. I got 100 experience. And watch it. Oh God. <clears throat> oh yeah, the Omni Blade. I forgot about the Omni Blade. Okay. Oh, dodge roll. Through this way. I'll put hey. a bullet in you, kid. It's okay. Everyone's dying. <laughs> Come here. I need to get you someplace safe. Take my hand. You can't help me. Shepard! In here. And he's gone. Yeah, screw that kid. I'm gonna say it every time he comes up too, because he comes up later. Screw that kid. Ah, this is a goddamn mess. Every minute these machines are here, thousands of innocent people die. I won't be responsible. It's hard enough fighting a war, but it's worse knowing no matter how hard you try, you can't save them all. Exactly. They get so fast. I thought we'd have more time. We knew they were coming. And they still just cut through our defenses. We need to go to the Citadel. Talk to the Council. The Citadel? The fight's here. It'll be everywhere soon enough. You said it yourself. <sighs> the Reapers will destroy everything if we don't stop them. The Council 
has to help us. You sure about that? No, but you're a Council Spectre. That has to count for something. Gotcha! <sighs> Thanks. I owe you one. More than one. Grab some ammo. Thanks, Keith David. Reload, let's keep moving. All right, let's get funky. Oh boy. God. Jeez. Hey, Commander Williams, we're in sight of the spaceport. ETA, three minutes. We've made it to the Normandy, taking heavy fire. Oh God. They're gonna take down that dreadnought. Invasive maneuvers. Lieutenant Commander, Ashley. Damn it, they're in trouble. We gotta get the hell out of Dodge. Oh boy. That's gone. Shit! Your leg should be broken in like 70 places. Normandy, we're going to reroute. Do you copy? Normandy, come in. Yeah, jump it. Friendlies. Eh, nothing up here. You two all right? Get down, they'll see you. Oh, that's pleasant. That's a Batarian. Keep your head down. Nice shot. Back at oh. Burn in hell. Oh, I still oh, I still have all my shit. I guess they're technically synthetic. Finish them all. Shepard, over here. Fuck him. What happened here? Our gunship was shot down. We barely made it. You have a radio? We're trying to contact our ship. No. There's one in the gunship, but it's gonna be crawling with those things. Okay. I'll go blast him in the Stay face. Here, son. We'll get you out of here. So I walked in and just started blasting. Come on. Let's get to that gunship. Yeah, I think I have all the yeah, okay. I'm full on ammo for this thing, although I would probably use some more. What the hell are those things? Bitches and hoes, Steven. Burn in hell, you creepy bastards. You can also carry a lot more ammo in this, I've noticed. Just immediately. I don't know if that's a mod. I don't I don't think it is. Oh god. No. No. Anderson, fuck him up. Okay, so yeah, you're um. In this one, your health doesn't regen the same way. I, they, they made it a bit more difficult to regen health, because you used to be able to, if you just hid, eventually all of your health would just regen. Looks like this time they're doing it in segmentations. Shepard, over here! Grab me that. I found a radio. Turn up the radio. Normandy, this is Anderson. Do you read? Admiral, what's your location? By a downed gunship in the harbor. I'm activating his distress beacon. 
Send support. I feel like it's a bad idea. Lieutenant! Damn it! I lost the signal. Let's hope that beacon does its job. And fast, we've got company. Shit tacky mushrooms. Oh, holy mother. I am your god now. I want my sniper rifle back. Hope they get there soon. You and me both. For the love of God. Give me my damn shields back. Running out of ammo. No shit, Sherlock. There's more of them. Go down! Fuck, I got no ammo. Cavalry's here, gentlemen. Thank you, God. Good work, Joker. Let's go. Run like <clears throat> men. Welcome back, Shepard. Thanks. Shepard! Come on! I'm not going. You saw those men back there. There's a million more like them, and they need a leader. We're in this fight together, Anderson. It's a fight we can't win. Not without help. We need every species and all their ships to even have a chance at defeating the Reapers. Talk to the Council. Convince them to help us. What if they won't listen? Then make them listen. Now go! That's an order! I don't take orders from you anymore, remember? Consider yourself reinstated, Commander. You know what you have to do. I'll be back for you, and I'll bring every fleet I can. Good luck. You too, Shepard. Guess it doesn't fix all the audio glitches. They made Ashley so much hotter in this, and it is very much appreciated. Land! Now we get to see a small child die. Hey, kid! Get on the boat. Oh, that's fun. It's a little reaper. You're going to die. Run, you stupid ass. Yeah, you don't have a fucking snowball's chance in hell. Bye! And again. Everyone died. I'm covered in human blood. Isn't this lovely? And the Normandy has finally gotten rid of those horrible looking Cerberus logos on it. In favor of Alliance logos, thank you. That is the only thing I hated about Mass Effect 2 is that you couldn't have that change because fuck the elusive man. Anybody want Calamari? Look, you can blow up California. We're okay with that. I don't even remember where that's supposed to be. That might be in... That might be Washington, D.C., I think. 
That is a hardcore opening mission, though. I do like that opening for this. And it is brutal to watch. Just because you're like, yeah, we've been preparing for this for two games. We're still getting our shit pushed in. Like, they, I will say this. They legitimately make the Reapers feel like a threat in this game. They don't make them feel like they're just throwaway villains. What the hell's going on? Where's Anderson? Where are we going? Hey! We're leaving. Leaving? What's going on? Anderson wants us to go to the Citadel, get help for the fight. Bullshit, he wouldn't order us to leave. We don't have a choice. Without help, this war is already over. Forget it. Drop me off someplace. Enough! Don't you think I'd rather stay and fight? We're going to the Citadel. You want out, you can catch a ride back from there. Commander! Joker, that you? Alive and kicking. Got an emergency transmission from Admiral Hackett for you. Patch it through. Shepard. Sustained heavy losses. The whole force was overwhelming. There's no way we can defeat them conventionally. Anderson's already ordered me to the Citadel to talk to the Council. First, I need you to find an outpost on Mars. Now we lose control of the system. Yes, sir. I've been researching the Prothean archives with Dr. Tassoni. We found a way to stop the Reapers. The only way to stop them. Contact soon. Hack it out. Joker. Set a course for the Mars Archives. Mars? Roger that. This is local. Why Mars? What does he think we'll find there? I don't know yet. But if it helps us win this war... Grab your gear. I'm getting back in my gimp suit, baby! Actually, I think I can change it after we go through this. Okay, alright, so here we go. Here we have our armor sets. Actually, we only have two. Two, three. Hmm. Alright, so we haven't gotten any uh, new armors or anything like that. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to keep the N7 helm. Just because I had the GIMP mask on before, I'll keep that on for right now, and we'll see what, uh, what we do here. Uh, but I think this is what we have. Casual. What, what, what are his other casual? Nope. That looks... That's not casual. That, that, that that's, that's BDSM. Alright, I'll keep with my, uh... No, I remember this. I'll keep it the leather jacket. I like the leather jacket. Okay. So there's only two... We only have two armor sets right now. We'll be able to pick up more along the way. We'll save and exit. Alright, let's see here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well... Can we use that? Okay. There's nothing there. What about Ash? Nothing there. Okay. Alright, that's confirming. We're going to Mars, everybody! Flying down with our uh, with our scout ship here. Try to reach Mars on secure channels. No one's answering. Any sign of Reaper activity? Negative. Edie. The base appears to be online. It's possible the inhabitants were evacuated. We'll know soon enough. Be ready, Joker. Just in case. Roger that. Normandy out. We're almost there. 
We're going in the hole, gentlemen. And Ashley. Ah, eh, fuck it, gentlemen. We're literally going in the hole. And we're gonna meet Liara, so this is gonna get awkward. We grew apart. I just want my boy Garrus back. Still no contact from the base, but we've got a massive storm headed our way. How long till it hits? Half hour tops. After that, we're gonna have difficulty keeping up comms with the Normandy. Understood. All right. All right. First things first. Switching over to my sniper rifle, and as usual, okay. Damn, that's a huge. Let's escape the select squad level up. Oh, so I get the level ups from the previous one as well. Nice. Okay. Okay. So. Whoop. Whoop. Nope. Don't want that. All right. So how do I? Okay, so these branch, and I forgot that these branch. Uh, so let's see here. What does this do? Increase impact radius, increases damage. Same thing with the other game. Always increase damage. Never, never don't increase damage. Yeah, no, I'm definitely upgrading that. Except for this. So melee damage isn't quite as important as health and shielding. So because of that, we're going to go into this. All right, so disruptor, cryo, incinerate, tactical cloak, sticky grenade, sabotage, operational mastery. That's for tactician and on and off the battlefield. Okay, those cost five, so I can't do either of those right now. We'll do the disruptor ammo. Glad my scan disruptor ammo has 50% effectiveness, increase health damage bonus by 3%, increase shield and barrier damage bonus by 12%. I'll do that. Oh. Okay. All right, so that's it for that. Um, and we already start off with a pretty good uh, Paragon boost because of what we were doing and a little bit of a Renegade because of what we did before. All right, so these ones, though, we have to level up entirely. So let's do this. All right, so damage per second versus radius. I think we'll do damage per second. More damage per second. All right, back. Marksman. I definitely want her to be accurate. We want a little bit in each. So that way uh, we make sure that she's pretty rounded out for the most part. Okay, I don't think I can put any more in there. Let's go back to James Vega. All right, so Arms Master, Health and Shields. All right, so that one gives us Weapon Damage Bonus. That one gives us a Shield Bonus. So let's that, let's see. That's 20% damage versus 40% Shields. I will take the Shielding Bonus. Radius, Damage, we will take the Damage Boost. Make sure he has his Incendiary Ammo. And we also make sure we want to have the frag grenade. So, uh, hang on. Okay. Back. All right. I still have one there, and I still have one for. I still have two for Ashley, but I can't spend these right now. Uh, so what we'll do is, um, once we level up again, we will do that. So that is going to be a confirmation. A lot bigger in person. Come on, Lieutenant. It's not that bad. Doesn't mean it can't kill us. I'm more worried about the war back on Earth, or the fact that nobody here is reporting in. Fair enough. Yeah, nobody reporting in from here, that is actually probably relatively concerning. Oh boy. Alright. Mars facility approach. That is nice, too, that they added that for, like, a, uh... For the, uh, you know, to find your way through missions and shit. Is there anything else up here? It doesn't look like it. Okay, so it looks like we're going down this way. What's that? Alliance. Sergeant Reeves. Doesn't look like he put up a fight. Something's not right here. Keep a low profile till we know what's going on. No Roger shit. That. No shit, Sherlock. Mars facility. 
I see. Holy shit. They're executing them. They know we're here now. And now you don't have a head. That is the other thing they did in this game, is they made sure that if you shot a jackass in the face, he no longer has a face. How many more of you do I need to kill? Oh, I wish I had that sniper slow down. Oh, fudge. And he's down. He's down, too. Anyone left? Those guys were Cerberus, weren't they? Sure looked like it. What's Cerberus doing here on Mars? Good question. You don't know? I'm not with them anymore, Ash, if that's what you're asking. It wasn't, but you have to admit, it's a bit convenient. Oh, shove it. Well, they're all dead. Alright, what else we got? They also made his stamina not shit! Oh, fudge. The AIs are a bit smarter. Like I said, it's been a, a hot minute. Are there more of you? I hear firefights. He's dead. Doesn't look like they came here in force. Yeah, just a few vehicles. Kinda suggests they had help. From the inside. Seems likely. You'd need a lot more men and firepower to take this place otherwise. So that, okay, I should probably run back here. I, 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 the, the, I need to be a bit more uh, savvy with Commander, the ammo. I thought you told servers to screw off after you wiped out that collector base they were after. That's exactly what I did. Well, one thing's for sure. They're no friend of the Alliance. Agreed. Okay. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Oh, here we go. Elevator control. That is what I was curious about. I need a straight answer, Shepard. Oh, about for the love what? of God. Do you know anything about this? What is Cerberus doing here? What makes you think I know what they're up to? You worked for them. How am I supposed to believe you've cut all ties? We joined forces to take down the Collectors. That's it. They rebuilt you from scratch. They gave your ship, resources... Let me be clear. I've had no contact with Cerberus since I destroyed the Collector base. And I have no idea why they're here now, or what they want. Commander Shepard's been under constant surveillance since coming back to Earth. No way they've communicated since. Sorry, Shepard. I just... Stop being a bitch, Ashley. I shouldn't have to explain myself to you, Ash. You're right. I think I should be putting my helmet Please. back on, right? Trust me. I do. Oh, there we it's go. It's just that. Liara! What are you doing? Oh, boy. Really? Why would you go into the duck system? Hi, fuckface! You know what's great about coming out of a vent? I know exactly where you're gonna be and I can shoot you in the face. They're dead. Well, actually, he's not quite yet. Good and good. Please don't shoot me. Easy there, Lieutenant. She's with us. Shepard, 
Thank the goddess you're alive. You too, Liara. I was so worried when the reports came in. I'm... sorry about Earth. Yeah. It was... difficult to leave. Ashley, I'm sorry. But why'd you come here? Hack had ordered us to come. Said you'd know what was going on. I do. Hallelujah. Some answers, finally. Maybe. I've discovered plans for a Prothean device. One that could wipe out the Reapers. Here on Mars? In the Prothean Archives, yes. We've known about the Archives for decades. Why now? Process of elimination, mixed with a little desperation. When you destroyed the Alpha Relay, you bought us some time. But then you were under investigation. I knew I had to do something. Hackett knew it too. He contacted me, asking if I would use my resources as a Shadow Broker to find a way to stop the Reapers. My search led me here. Hackett got me access to the Archives and kept me updated on your status. I meant to come see you, but... I think your work here is a bit more important. I suppose it is. In any case, my work paid off. The Archives are full of data, an overwhelming amount. I think I found what we need. Sounds like this weapon might be our best chance to blow the Reapers to hell. It's not a weapon, not yet. It's plans for a device, a blueprint. It's more than we had a minute ago. How do we get it? The Archives are just across that tramway. Assuming Cerberus hasn't locked it down. What are they after? Yeah, they seem hell-bent on catching you. They want what I'm here for. What we're all here for. But why? The Protheans came close to defeating the Reapers. They had plans to destroy them, but ran out of time. And anything powerful enough to destroy the Reapers... Just might be something Cerberus would be interested in. So it's a race to the Archives. Well, Fudge. We've got company. I'm gonna put bullets in your balls. On. Not this time, James. What? Get back to the shuttle. If Cerberus beats us to the Archives, I need you covering the exits. But... Now, Lieutenant. They're getting closer. I we hate James. Cover. He's so annoying. Well, actually, I shouldn't say, he's not as bad as Caden. Caden, Caden like is a bit more us. annoying. Ah, you fuck shit. You can't hide forever. There goes your head. Goodbye. Sweet chariot. Not a problem for someone with biotics. That's all of them. Good. Let's find a way up. Okay. Ooh, meta gel. I'll take that. I got 100 XP just from finding the meta gel. That's interesting. I don't remember that from, uh, well, again, I only ever played this game once a long time ago. Ironically, I've played Mass Effect Andromeda more times than I've actually played Mass Effect 3. That is actually kind of sad in a couple ways. Ooh, vehicle lift. This is a secure station. How did Cerberus get in? Not sure. One minute we were getting reports of the Reaper invasion. The next, there was chaos. Didn't even realize it was Cerberus at first. Could they be working with the Reapers? They've sabotaged the Go elevator. For Look for another I suppose way out. anything's possible. Crap. Alright. Like I said, platforming. Major improvements. And the AI is actually not uh, not stupid. Again, they improved on Mass Effect 2. The AI is uh, in this one is far superior to obviously to one, and it is it is still superior to two actually as well. It's uh, it's a little bit higher up there. Okay, let's go to the next room. Shepard, take cover. Oh God. Ooh. Quick kill! Wow. Right in the face! Oh, 
And he's dead. They do a lot more meat splatter in this. I do like that. Alright, well, um, are the rest of you dead? Or do I need to put more bullets in you? We'll need access to the pedway. Controls should be nearby. Okay, well, he's dead. Rocket technology gauntlets. Okay. Ooh, okay, so that's... Damn it. That's how Security's we pick those up. Security console... Ooh. And you can actively change your loadout. That's actually pretty fun. Okay. Okay. So those are the machine pistols. Okay. More XP. Hmm, that's odd. Shepard, see if you can gain access to the pedway. Pedway? What the hell is that? I can't seem to unlock the live feeds, but... Hey, did you see that? Who's that woman in the vid? That's Dr. Eva Kore. She got here about a week ago. And oh. look. So she's Pedway the server's contact. Alright, looks like there's construction nearby. We can get out on the roof. We can find a way around from there. Great. Let's move. Switching back to my sniper rifle because I'm not a bitch. Alright, let's see here. What we got anything else in here? You do still have to collect stuff. It is a lot like Mass Effect 2 in that respect, where you do have to kind of comb the uh, the environments as you're going through to make sure that you get everything. Oh, boy. All right, everybody. This is going to be funky. What the hell? Looks like the Alliance is still putting up a fight. That tram heads to the archives. Look back. Ooh, that's a case of something. Barely. Storm's causing interference. Because they're fabricator chest plays right back here. I didn't read that. James, repeat. Well, we're bound. Damn it. That storm's going to be in here very soon. Yeah, I think it's already here. Good point. Swear to God, woman. This airlock shouldn't be open. Doesn't look like it was forced. No, you have to override security protocols. All right, we're going in. Flashlights. Someone vented the air from this room while they were still here. Looks like they died trying to claw their way out. This is brutal, even by Cerberus standards. From... Show De Hen to Cameron Harrison. Cam, who the hell is that woman messing in my files? Get her out of here. I won't have my system messed up by some wannabe expert who'll be gone next week. Damn strangers who think they know it all but don't care about what we're really trying to achieve here. Dr. Ava, seriously? Don't you remember what happened last time? Huh, okay. Oh, and you get experience from reading those, okay. Alright, what else we got in here? Just gotta double check and locate everything. I want to touch everything. I want to touch it all. Flashlights. What's our order? There's an alliance force in here somewhere. We need to kick them away. He's dead. Not quite sticking out good enough. He's dead. Come on.
Well, he's dead. Ooh, SMG scope. I'll pick that up. So yeah, they do have, um, I think they added, um, in this game, if I remember correctly, they added on, uh, like, weapon modifications and stuff like that. Uh, so we will be finding those along the way. We will find different weapon modifications that we'll be able to pick up and apply to different weapons, which will be, which is fun. I like that. Alright, so it looks like we can leap over this. Take a quick peek over here. Anything? Got a gel, I'll take that. Thermal mags. Anything else in here? Nope. Okay, so it's just that. We need to pressurize the room first. There we go. We have access to the labs. They'll take us right to the tram station. Hey, looks like there's a recording of what happened here. Security station. Come in. We're seeing some odd activity down here. Our security protocols just kicked in. Everything's locked down. Doctor, I'll get you a report as soon as... Well, there's your Cerberus plant. I'm gonna put one in your head. And then she vented all the oxygen and I killed everybody. I guess we know how Cerberus got in. You piece I should have realized garbage. it when I met her. I was just so focused on finding a way to stop the Reapers. Stopping the Reapers is the only thing we should be focused on. It's not your fault. But what if we're wrong? What if there's no way to stop them? What if these are our last days and we spend them scurrying around trying to solve a problem we can't fix? Liara. I know. I shouldn't think that way. I don't know how you do it. You've always stayed focused even in the worst situations. When there's so much at stake, I think about my friends, loved ones, what I'd lose if I failed. Me too. We'll stop them, Liara. Together. I believe you. Or I believe that you believe. Maybe that's enough. So is she okay, just totally doors cool? Open. We can get to the labs and tram station through there. Good. Let's move. All right, I got my helmet back on, and we're about ready to do some weirdo crap. Did I increase in, uh... Oh, I did get some more stuff. Okay, so let's see here. Weight capacity bonus. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave with that. All right. Looks like we're going through this door. Go. SMG ultralight materials. Okay. What is this? Weapon bench. Okay, so I think all that does is it just brings up your weapons. From Amelia Hatterson, Michael Sullivan. Hey, stupid head. I won't ask how you're doing since I hear you guys are propagating germs in the shape of, coal, of a cold down there in storage. Look, I know your Prothean doodads are fascinating and all, but you guys have got to stop burning the midnight oil and keep regular sleep hours, honestly. Anyway, I forwarded your files findings to HQ on Earth, and someone is depressurizing the area, worn secure. <laughs> That's not good. I fuck not. Servers are bitches. Also, uh, yeah, I remember these things, and I remember you can do this, which is put one right through the fucking mail slot. One shot, one kill. Who else is left? Anything in here? Yay, nay. Where are you? Oh, hi. 
Hello? Can you hear me? Bye bye. Come on, load him up. He's down. I have no ammo left in that. Just go the fuck down! Gives me the ability to flank this door, though. Let's go down! I will put one in your asshole, damn it. Dear God, man, how many bodies do I have to leave behind me before you get the fucking point? going on in there. That's the tram line. Takes us right to the archive. No doubt Cerberus has it locked down. Hopefully we can override it at the security station. It's just through here. Huh. So what is this? Oh, okay. So that's what that does. What the fudge? Okay. Alright, so that was the way I came. I think I have to go through the stupid clean room. Or I have the option to, anyway. It goes this way. Alright, that goes around the corner. Ooh, here we go. I'll take that. Ooh, that's a, that is a, uh, that's a suppressor. Okay. Shotgun high barrel over barrel. Damn, I am racking this up right now. I forget if you can max out in this game. I know you can in the other two, but uh, I'm curious if it actually lets you in this. I don't remember if it does. All right, let's see here. All right, taking the sniper rifle out again because I might need that. There can't be that many more Cerberus a-holes here. I'll take that. Okay, so I picked that up. What else is over here? Anything? Nope. Okay. Alright. Look out! Oh, shenanigans! No kidding. Is that the only way in? It's the only way I know of. We'll skirt around it. Stay out of its sights. I'll move up first. Don't let it 
target you. Get me out of here. Okay. Stay in cover, Shepard. Yeah. Dodge roll. Dodge roll. We're clear. The turret can't fire on us from here. I will kill all you idiots and blow up your heads. He's down. Just go down. So rifle. All right, I'm like 99% sure he's dead. Research notes, G. Tasman. The last location seems to have run dry, but judging from the communication systems layout and the backup power supplies equipped by the first Prothean research base we discovered, we think a secondary base may be located deeper underground. We're going to need permission from the power that, from the powers that be to excavate further, but considering the recent renewal and enthusiasm for the work we're doing here, I don't think clearance will be an issue. Interesting. All right, pick that up. Okay, that is the auto turret control, which I'm not going to activate quite yet. Just going to do a quick look around. Okay, doesn't look like there's anything else in here of note. Uh, we already examined that. Set up a perimeter. No one else comes across. We still have teams on the other side. No one. And shut down those cameras. Bitch, I'm gonna put a bullet looks in your like head. Looks like they've made it to the archives. And it looks like they won't be sitting a tram anytime soon. Can you override it? The archives are on a separate network. We're completely locked up. Not completely. What if we could find a short-range transmitter? Helmet to helmet. And? And then we convince them that we're with them. And the Alliance forces have been taken care of. Good idea. See what you can find. What? The Lieutenant Commander has become very capable. Agreed. Commander, I found something. You're pissy because I slept with a quarry and aren't what you? What have you got? He's got a transmitter in his helmet. If I can... Oh. That's lovely. Oh god. He looks like a husk. What? Yeah. Not quite. But they've definitely done something to him. Engineered? By Cerberus? They claim to stand for humanity, and they do this to their own people. That could have been you, Shepard. For all I knew, that's what Cerberus had done to you. How can you compare me to that thing? I don't know what you are. Not since they got their hands on you. Is it really you? Would you even know if they were controlling you somehow? That's not fair, Ash. I'm just talking out loud. I don't need you to answer. I, I doubt there's anything you could say to convince me. I guess I just need some time to get to know you again. I'm the same person I always was. Time won't change that. But if that's what you need, I understand. Thanks. For understanding. You bet. Let's see if we can get that tram sent over here. Hello, 
This is Delta Team. Anybody there? Where the hell have you been? Never mind, what's your status? We're at the tram station, waiting for extraction. All hostiles terminated. Roger that. Echo Team will ride over and secure the station. Think they bought it? If they didn't, they'll figure it out soon enough. We should get in position. Flank them when they get off the tram. Good thinking, LC. Understood. Got it! Alright. Got it! I'm on it! Here they come. Come on. We have contact distance. Shit. Need my sniper rifle. There goes your head. I'm surprised you actually found one of the dead Cerberus guys that actually still had a face. There goes your face. And your face. Your face is no more. Like I said, I'm actually more shocked you found one that still had a face for me to look at because I seem to be blowing most of them off. God, I love that. Alright, let's go. Uh, cable car control. I think there's anything else in here to grab. Doesn't look like it anyway. Oh boy. Storm's getting bad. We better wrap this up quickly. The archives are right on the other side. That and the squad of pissed off Cerberus troops. Fudge. Well, we're boned. Hey, remember how I chose the class that could shoot you from really far away? Thank you for sending me really far away to shoot you. Come on, poke your stupid head up. Ow. Come on. They put up a good fight. Yes, it confirms the really? assertions about the value of the data stored here. All right, let's see here. All right, reload my rifle. We will continue on. We're gonna get freaky, ain't we? Oh Lord. One sniper around left. Switch over to the assault rifle. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. Snipe his ass. That 
that dude's dead. Oh boy. I will shoot you in the fucking knees, man. How many more? It's time to get some ammo. Ammunition. I have so much ammo. Ooh, shotgun shredder, I'll take that. Medical. Vindicator. Oh, yeah, change that loadout. Give me that fucking thing instead of this piece of crap. Yep. Okay. What I really want is my Goss rifle back, because that shit was fun. Alright, we're just going to take a very quick look around here. Make sure we're not missing anything. Which I don't believe we are. So, let's go around here. So, does this do anything? Nope. Okay, so that means we just go through this door. Open the door. Anybody else want to lose their head? What in the fudge have you done? Ash. Let's do butt stuff. Oh, I'm gonna put a bullet in your face. Shepard. Elusive man. Fascinating race, the Protheans. They left all this for us to discover, but we squandered it. Did the we? Alliance has known about the archives for more than 30 years. And what have they done with it? What do you want? What I've always wanted. The data in these artifacts holds the key to solving the Reaper threat. I've seen your solution. Your people are turned into monsters. Hardly. They're being improved. You're an idiot. Improved? That's what separates us, Shepard. Where you see a means to destroy, I see a way to control, to dominate and harness the Reaper's power. Imagine how strong humanity would be if we controlled them. Earth is under siege, and you're hatching a scheme to control the Reapers? You've always been short-sighted, hasty. Your destruction of the Collector base proved that. I destroyed that base because I didn't trust you with the information. This isn't your fight any longer, Shepard. You can't defeat the Reapers, even with the Prothean data. Work with me. Give me control of your resources, and I'll stop them. You'd do better than most, but the odds aren't in your favor. More importantly, I don't want the Reapers destroyed. We can dominate them, use their power, harness their very essence to bring humanity to the apex of evolution. You've gone too far. The Reapers will kill us all if we don't stop fighting each other. I don't expect you to understand, Shepard. And I'm certainly not looking for your approval. You I'm gonna team, kill you. An agent with a singular purpose. And despite our differences, you were relatively successful. But like the rest of the relics in this place, your time is over. Enough talk. Liara. 
Don't interfere with my plan, Shepard. I won't warn you again. Duly noted. Shepard. What? The data, it's not here. It's being erased. Goodbye, Shepard. I'm gonna kill you. Damn it. How's he doing it? It's local. Someone's uploading the information. Hey! Step away from the console. Now! She's a ninja? Oh, I'm gonna break your fucking uh, face. Got the data. Yeah, not for long. She's faster than she looks. Stay close. We can't lose her. Thank God they didn't make his stamina shitty in this. Radio the Normandy. Get them down here now. She's getting away. Damn it. James. Normandy. Anybody. I got this one. Holy monkeys! Oh! Jesus, man! Well, that worked. How the fuck is that thing still flying? Jesus, man! Normandy's en route. They'll be here soon. We need the data. What is that? That's not good. What the fudge? Signatures in orbit. Ash. Ashley. We're getting ourselves out of here, everybody. Before the Reapers show up and kill everyone. And that is the tutorial mission, everybody. Loading, loading, loading. Loading, loading, loading.
Ashley needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Ash. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Commander, I'm receiving a signal over the secondary QEC. I believe it's Admiral Hackett. Patch me through. I'll forward it to the comm room. Commander. Edie, can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop him. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. I hope so. Lieutenant Commander Williams was critically wounded. We're taking her to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Talk to the Council, show them what you found. With luck, they'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Good work. Shepard? Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we reach the Citadel. And Lieutenant Commander Williams? I've done what I can for her. She needs proper medical attention soon. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? Unless we stop the Reapers. Yeah. Look at me in my mask. I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer, if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. You didn't see what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Shepard. Isn't it worth trying, at least? I'm going to check on Ashley and James. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't. You're not wrong. Alright, as soon as I get a chance to stop and save, I will stop and save and we'll call the session. I think we're probably running a pretty good amount over by now. Back to the Citadel, baby. Whee! We've murdered all the Keepers. Fuck those bitches. Oh, I like how it has like a little trail through the clouds if you actually look up. That's neat. That, that, that's actually a really fun little like uh, visual thing. Out of all three of the games, honestly, this one probably looks the most beautiful. Um... Andromeda even doesn't look this good, and this game came out like four or five years before that. Alright. Barely got a pulse here. Move him out. Where are you taking her? Where to Memorial. Best care in the Citadel. We're not going with? We need to see the Council. Right. I'm in my... Looks like they might be coming to see you. Commander Shepard. Got word you were arriving. Captain Bailey! Captain I remember Bailey. you. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Congratulations. Um, uh, thanks. 
Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. None taken. So, you're here to bring us to the Council? I'm here to tell you the Council is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Adina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Thanks. I might do that. You go on ahead. I'll head up to Adina's office. One of my men can show you the way. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. Commander, we've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. Hmm. I'll be right there. The other half of my job. I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. All right, so we are officially at the Citadel now. Um, ooh, we got 35,000 credits. That is a nice one. Ooh, plus another 10,000 with Alliance funding. I remember Udina, too. Fuck Udina. Also keepers. All right, so that's how we get back to the Normandy. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to save. And we will call this session here, and I will come back later on, and we will go talk to the Council about the Reaper War. Talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye.